Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to show you all how I do my apple cider vinegar rinse. So as you can see, first I'm going to take the apple cider vinegar and I'm going to mix it with some coconut oil and some water. And then also, of course, you need your applicator bottle and I just used an old Dugo growth oil applicator bottle. So first I'm going to mix my apple cider vinegar. I kind of just eyeballed that and made it just a little bit and I added some coconut oil to that as well now the reason why I added the coconut oil to the rinse was because apple cider vinegar is already acidic and I think adding oil kind of helps balance that a little bit when you add it to your scalp but it's all a matter of personal preference so here I am sectioning off my hair in four sections to make it a lot easier to manage. My hair is so dry and the only reason why I decided to do this apple cider vinegar is because of dryness but to also because my hair has been so itchy. So I'm trying to clarify my scalp completely and get it all stripped. I know that sound kind of bad but I want to make sure that my scalp is completely clean before I add any other products to my hair. So here I am applying the rinse directly to my scalp and I'm rubbing it in with the balls of my fingers making sure that I get it squeaky clean. And then here you'll see me applying it more to the hair as well to make sure it gets all down the hair shaft. Now some benefits of apple cider vinegar rinses is that they balance the hair and scalp which allows for smoother hair and makes it easier to detangle and gives hair shine and less frizz. And then also it keeps your scalp healthy, clarifies and exfoliates which is the reason why I'm doing it and it gives volume and curl definition to the hair.
Now this step is completely optional. I just wanted to make sure that my scalp really was clean. So I just added a little bit more of the mixture to the scalp, making sure that I got every inch and angle of my type four hair. Cause my hair has been itching and I just want to make sure that I'm doing all that I need to do to get this itching. I don't even know if this is the proper procedure to get that itching to go away, but I'm going to just start by cleansing my scalp first. Okay, so done me. I'm showing you guys this because I use this shampoo every week and it already has apple cider vinegar in it. So this couldn't be why my hair is itching. I don't know if this is going to help. I don't know. But next I'm going to take my Aussie Moist three times deep conditioner and I'm going to rinse the apple cider vinegar out and I'm going to deep condition my hair with this for three minutes. So as mentioned, I'm going to go ahead and take the Aussie Moist 3-Minute Deep Conditioner and put that all on my hair. You guys have already seen a deep conditioning process for me or how I've applied my deep conditioner. So I'm going to just go ahead and do this section and then skip right to what my hair looks like after I rinse everything or after I rinse this out. So I am all done here. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video and hope you found it helpful. And don't forget to give it a thumbs up. If you liked it, leave a comment and also hit that red subscribe button and then hit the bell button so you'll never miss when I post another video. And I will catch you guys later. Bye.